Aggregate supply is the sum of goods and services an economy is willing and able to produce in a period of time. In the short run, the aggregate supply curve, AS curve for short, slopes upwards. Let's see why. Assuming nothing else changes, at higher prices, firms may expect to gain more revenue and profits and produce more output at Y1. At a lower price level, firms expect lower revenue and profits and produce less output at Y2. AS can shift following changes in firms' costs, including wages and raw materials and factor productivity. Lower costs shift AS to the right and higher costs shift AS to the left. Supply-side policies are longer-term policies which attempt to improve the productivity and flexibility of labour and the competitiveness of firms. Measures include removing rigidities in the labour market, business startup incentives, incentives to use new technology, encouraging individuals to work, promoting training, education and a healthy workforce and removing obstacles to competition. The long-run aggregate supply curve is influenced by supply-side policy. Although vertical, it can shift if productive potential increases. Fiscal policy cannot permanently reduce unemployment below the non-accelerating rate of unemployment, or NERU for short, as it leads to accelerating inflation. For example, if NERU is at 6%, Point A, a fiscal stimulus will simply result in a short-term reduction in unemployment to 4%, point B. However, if the long-run Phillips curve is shifted to the left through supply-side policy, NARU can drop to 4% without inflationary pressure.